Wow. Hello. Welcome to the Sunday Night High Wire Jam. Yay. I'm so excited uh, to be here. I'm so excited. We have a really fun group tonight. Uh, yeah, this is the High Wire Jam. We're here every Sunday um, at seven o'clock. Um, and, you know, while you're here, while you're watching, go ahead and uh, please like our video. Uh, you know, go ahead and, uh, you know, subscribe to us on YouTube. And while you're on your phone, I'm sure you've got your phone, you know, very close to you. Uh, go ahead and like us on Instagram, follow us on Instagram. We have some hot, hot content on there pretty much daily. And uh, give us a like on Facebook. Um, we don't really do Twitter. So, you know, don't, don't look for us on Twitter. But um, I don't know, if you think we should have a Twitter, uh, just comment below. You can get that sweet, sweet engagement. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and bring out all of our jammers. Woo! Come on, everybody, come on out, everyone. <laughs> Woo hey, jammers. Hello. Hi, everybody. Woo pretend, pretend there's music. I have my. It's coming through my headphones, not the speakers, and I can't figure that. Out. <laughs> sing. That's okay. You can just sing it for us. Mm -hmm. no. Oh, hey, Brian, um, why don't hey. you uh, get us started with uh, any word at all? Mm. OK, uh, let me look at this book here. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Tight ship. Tight ship. <laughs> any word at all? He's trying oh, to find one. It's There's a, a lot. It's a book of is writing. this a book of no words? <laughs> yes, it's a book of writing prompts. So it's mostly not discovery. <gasps> discovery. Discovery. Ooh, discovery. discovery. Thank you. Here All we go. Right. <laughs> wow. Well, I never thought I'd be saying this, but welcome to Space Shuttle Discovery, fellow crew. <laughs> I've Can been you waiting for it? this. Can you I believe it? We're on the space shuttle. It's so exciting. I mean, <laughs> who would have thought we're only fourth graders? Usually they give this job to sixth graders. I know. <laughs> <laughs> guys, 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 guys. Didn't you try the freeze dried ice cream yet? Uh, yeah, that was the first thing I tried. <laughs> of course. <laughs> like, who? <laughs> The or the cookies and cream and like the cookies, I let them go and they started like just like floating up and I was like, oh, we are in space. Hey, <laughs> guess what? Did what? you did you put your butt on the window? <laughs> <laughs> no, but should I? Yeah. <laughs> well, maybe I did. <laughs> it's so sad, but I I totally thought that was your butt print. Like I don't yeah. know how I knew, but I was like, yep, that's Gregory. If you <laughs> if you go the in the spacesuit up. <laughs> Cut to the adults on the Discovery. <laughs> <laughs> Same thing I was thinking. So whose idea was this to let these school kids on? I, I, me, it, <laughs> listen, I, nobody else makes fart noises when the jet engines blow. You guys won't do that. So I had to get somebody up here who would, you know, indulge me. Okay, but like we couldn't hear what what houston was trying to communicate to us because of all the noise in the space shuttle plus those children making those horrible noises get back, to the, back kids. to the kids <laughs> <laughs> all right guys it's ready for takeoff <laughs> we're on a rocket do you think the teachers enjoy like our company on this spaceship oh my I God. mean, why else would they invite us uh you know what's really fun <laughs> I mean, what? take in your water bottle and if you shake it, it puts like droplets everywhere. <laughs> I mean, what? sure, it gets on their reports that they need to do, but like, oh. <laughs> if you next time could aim it maybe at our homework, like that they're supposed oh. to give us after this. Cut back, Cut to, back the to the adults. <laughs> so, um, did you guys read my report? No, it was all stuck together. It was one oh. big freaking pile. They'd made it into one giant spitball, Brian. <laughs> I Well, I wrote it, and the first letter of each paragraph spells out D's nuts. <laughs> <laughs> you know, maybe instead of being in the cockpit, you should be back there. <laughs> Cut back to the kids. <laughs> guys, guys, guess what we're in right now? What? Where are we in? The cockpit! 
Scene, scene, scene. <laughs> hey, so uh, Queen Isabella, baby. Chris Columbus here. Yes. <laughs> and, and King Ferdinand and I'm just the jester, jester, man. Like, okay. leave me out of this shit. The court jester. <laughs> leave me out. <laughs> so I'm I'm back. I'm back from uh, finding a shorter route to uh, <laughs> discovering a shorter route to India, and I have I've brought many wonders, and uh, and I've, I've, I have I uh, have discovered a lot of land. Nice. And Spain is just going to be ruling the new world. Yeah, high five. And, and, and whew, there we go. Woo, woo, woo. And um, there's, there's, a, there's a bunch of people there. Oh. Uh, what was not expecting. Do um, they like comedy? I'm, I'm down for that. <laughs> I'm, yeah. Okay, I'm uh, no. as queen, I feel I need to come clean here <clears throat> and no. let you know that. Um, Your Majesty? We. We were kind of hoping you'd get lost. Um, we didn't really want you to come back. Um, see, I'm friends with the Vikings, and they've already been there. And they told me that if you went, it probably wouldn't end well. So I'm like, yeah, let's send Chris over there. He's bugging me. Sorry. Well, it's really such a downer. Well, well hey, I mean, should I... I do a joke now? Would that help? Is this the right yeah. time? Just wait one second. Just wait one second. Sweet. He's going to say So, I, I, okay. I got lost. And I didn't find India. I found something entirely new. And they have wonderful, wonderful natural resources. I mean, there's, there's, there's so much um, gold and, and, and silver and iron and steel and uh, the, um, but most of the islands are extremely fertile and we can grow all kinds. Here, look what I brought you. I brought you corn. Oh. <laughs> look, look at the Bro, chest. Look at the chest. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's funny, Jester. That's funny. Hey, so hey. It's, it's just that, like I said, now there, there are hundreds of thousands of people there. So you have essentially, you know, the, the doubled your reign now. I, I, I'm, um, I'm just going to make an executive decision here. What you just brought us was maize, not corn. We're going to call it maize. Scene. Uh -oh. <laughs> <clears throat> All right. Um, Neil Armstrong, Buzz Aldrin. <laughs> I'll be honest. We, uh, we didn't think you were going to get off the moon. <laughs> kind of wanted you to stay there. Uh, <laughs> Wow. So this is kind of awkward. I mean, welcome back to Earth. But... <laughs> hold, hold on, let's let's reverse what I'm, you just I'm said. Confused. Whoa, 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 whoa! You pulled us back in. <laughs> yeah, we it was were, like dancing around on the moon, and next thing you know, we were being yanked back by our our air thing. I was so perfect. sorry. Sorry, I'm late. I'm here for the levity while you give the important news. <laughs> right, right. I was, this is I was our perfectly th fine on the moon like you know like we made a life up there we was living at large like top dogs on the yeah moon. and, and we you come friends. and jerk us away yeah we made right. friends we made friends and classified yeah. friends we can't talk about but we made friends <laughs> yeah and i think they even had some maize or some like little food stuff that was on a on a piece uh, of it's, uh, sorry, we're 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 calling it space corn. All right. Like, <laughs> where can everyone, where can everyone everyone keep Jess? Keep Jess. <laughs> hey. I'm just <laughs> listen, I'm not trying to be like a problem. But like I felt like we really had like a connection up mm. on the moon. Mm -hmm. <laughs> here, but like you can't like tell any of your family or like your other friends about me. Like I'm I'm starting to feel kind of like like not great. Yeah, babe, like not great. Babe, it's cause you're classified. Like you should feel <laughs> real exclusive 
that like I can't introduce you to my family and friends. First of all, you don't want to meet them. Let's just be honest. <laughs> um, and secondly, you're a class. Like think how you're classy. Just as we could drop the five <laughs> part. You're just classy. That's okay, why. Like, the whole classified thing. Like, yeah, it was sexy for mm-hmm. a while. Mm-hmm. It's like, you know, I, I want to shout from the rooftops, you know, like I'm in love with Neil Armstrong. <laughs> Now, okay. don't get me wrong. There's a lot of people that would want to yell that from the rooftop. But what really <laughs> I can't let you do. If you do that, they're going to lock me away. And it's not going to be the moon this time. <laughs> well, I'll See? go with you. Oh. So, Dr. Fauci. Dr. Fauci. Yes. Dr. Fauci. Yes. We have the vaccine. Yes. We have the coronavirus vaccine. Congratulations. It is ready. It is ready. ready. And here's the good news. It does not have to be be kept at at, at, at 75 degrees centigrade. It can be kept at room temperature. It can be, the shelf life is more than a year. We can distribute it quickly. Sounds excellent. Let me do it for you. And so the vaccine is all in here and it needs to be injected directly into the eye. Okay, open your eyes wide. You're the first one. <laughs> whoa, wait, whoa, whoa, wait, wait, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait. So tag, just... tag, tag out Casey, tag out Casey. <laughs> what, what they don't know what they don't know is these scientists <laughs> is there's a clause there's a clause that you have to, we have to inject into their eyeballs and they have to be the first people to get it we've totally they think they're working hard to benefit mankind but we're just messing with them <laughs> i go DZ. <laughs> all right sir i know this is on an ethical project and i worked very hard here at the department of defense and i mm-hmm. finally came up with the instant diarrhea injection. So I, I hope you guys are happy. <laughs> okay, okay. Let's rewind. Let's rewind. This sounds like a classified project. Are, are we trying to give or prevent the diarrhea? I'm, 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 I'm unclear. Here. Hey, listen. This is I don't I don't question military projects. I just you told me you're fired unless you make an injection that gives I you instant you diarrhea. That? And like, I told hey, you that. Wow. Do not remember that. Was this a uh, prank? I'm I'm guessing it was either a prank or it's actually a prevention of diarrhea. Um, oh, good lord! You, you know guys, what you did? What's wrong? I'm just like I'm the diarrhea vaccine, and I'm really tired of just everyone like being so mean to me. Like I can't help it that I'm diarrhea, but everyone's like mm, diarrhea is just the worst thing. And it's like you know what, like. Maybe you're sick and maybe like the diarrhea. I, I, I don't know, I just feel really maligned and I'm I, tired of being a joke. I think you buried the lead. You made a talking vaccine. Oh, don't tell me that was a <laughs> <laughs> You said make vaccines talk and I did it, all right? Tag out Brian and Brandon, leave Kristen. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? Like, I, I'm, I, I thought this was your chance to like make it and they are still not taking you seriously oh my gosh i mean i'm just the common cold like nobody cares about me (laughs) like uh take a sick day you'll get over it but like diarrhea is something that people take seriously i know like you can say you have diarrhea you can basically get get out of like literally anything (laughs) anything well you know i decided i'm coming in as covid and I'm trying to be very elusive and they can't seem to catch me. So, I mean, if they can't get you two, how are they ever gonna catch me? Uh, <laughs> diarrhea, my mom said not to hang out with like the really bad types and I've heard the yeah. code is like a really bad type. Yeah, like, you just wait. They're all coming for you. Just like they came <laughs> for me, smallpox. And they almost oh wiped me off the face of the planet. Smallpox, <laughs> no, things are different Same. now. See. <laughs> <laughs> hey hey what's up old virus over there you're cute 
you know, I, I, I give I give people a run for their money sometimes out their nose, but you get it. See, <laughs> bring back Kristen from the moon. <laughs> hey, like, hey. oh my God! Did you tell him that it was called uh, Space Corn? Still nothing. Oh come on, <laughs> maze space corn. I mean, I didn't really want to start a big argument about this, but yes, this is this is what we're talking about. Look, care what I have known Kristen my whole life, Buzz. I didn't want to get into this in front of you. <sighs> Fine. Yeah, you know, I just listen. I t- I'm just tired of being kept a secret. You know, it's like I have feelings. I have, I have like things I want to do. I have emotions. Okay, I have interests. How are you responding she, to this? Is she is she done yet? Is she done? <gasps> I hear you. I have. I'm sorry. Ears. I might be like a, a moon creature, but I I still have feelings. You're a moon have... baby. You're a moon baby. Okay. Wow. Is that what you're uh, calling me now? A moon baby? A moon baby. We didn't come up with that. I've been calling her classy. <laughs> I'm, pretty, <laughs> I'm pretty sure NASA did not send astronauts into space so that we can make moon babies on the moon and grow space corn. First all right? of all, y'all this had is, me this up is there for far 40, beyond the mission. You had me up there for 40 years. What did you expect me to do up there? What Look, you, you guys came here to our space and we welcomed you in with open mm-hmm. arms. What was it just a all, way to kill time? No. All my bestie no. wants is for you to acknowledge that she's like important to you. She and is important. I brought her all the way back here, galaxies away. Like we flew through so many stars to get here. Like, why do you make me hide under the bed when you have company? Oh, come on. At first, okay, yes. I did tell you it was a game that we played here in, in the Earth called Hide and Seek. And it, sure, yeah. it was fun the for a seat. couple. Yeah, he knows the game. <laughs> but like, yeah, baby, I only Saturn do it because brain. I love you. If Look, remember the movie I showed you last week, E.T.? That's what they'll do to you if they find you, what they did Me. to E.T. Honestly, probably Me. we will do that. <laughs> So I have discovered this new type of corn, which can grow without oxygen. It can grow without gravity, but it tends to grow sideways. And it will feed everyone. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Space maze. Yeah. We've, uh, you're you you're mean, just figuring this out? You mean you discovered it before me? Oh, man. I mean, we, we tried to... We tried to let you down easy, but like, yeah, we've we've actually been going through your notes. Um, and every time you're on the precipice of a discovery, we discover it first, but then we let you do it anyway. Yeah, Casey, Casey, she's just finding out about Space Maze. Oh, hello. I'm Julia Child. I have made these recipes from Maze, Space Corn, whatever you want to hear it. I would love mm. for you to sample them. These Look. Are- those Space corn, corn pancakes are floating in corn the air. Pancakes, Brandon. Oh yes. Succotash. <laughs> oh, succotash. What's? What? I thought I thought we were doing space maze. Succotash is corn and lima beans. Don't you no. know anything? Suck your tash. Whoa. <laughs> oh, <laughs> <me. laughs> bring back bring this. Oh, I'm here. <laughs> Hello. You can Hello. Open the door. Yes. Yes, I'm here. Finally, um, I have been hearing some weird noises coming from your apartment. They almost sound like really woo woo. Um, and I, I, I am here to investigate. I think you've got something really weird going on in here. Um, I don't know what it is, but it's driving me crazy. Well, first you're you're my neighbor, right? I'm your downstairs neighbor. Okay. And so I do hear you have of like a, the- okay? Do you have like a warrant to come into my apartment? You say you're gonna search it, but you know I just gotta make sure that you got the legality to search it. 
I mean. Oh, well, I'm searching because I'm concerned for your safety. Oh, fine. Look, I'm, I'm here. Woo-hoo. I mean, I'm, I'm a-okay. Woo-hoo. Are you really okay? <laughs> Tag out, Jess. <laughs> Uh, hey, Mary Jo, um, listen, I, I really appreciate you and like the rest of the neighbors watch, like su- being super vigilant and wanting to take care of everybody. But um, there's no such thing as a neighbor warrant. OK, that's not <laughs> that's not like a legal thing. We can't you can't demand to search people's apartments just because you hear a weird noise. OK, well, I, I understand. I did talk to a lawyer friend of mine oh. and based on concern health and mental concern for my neighbors yes. they did say that there was such thing as a neighbor warrant uh-huh. okay tag out uh, Kristen. <laughs> that, that, that's that's just my cell phone ringtone no you can't look through my purse to investigate it <laughs> but i'm very concerned about your purse your purse seems to have some weird shapes that are coming up that i can see on the outside and I'm thinking there's something in there, like a gun or something. Okay, ma'am, ma'am, you were not an air marshal. There's no such thing as like citizen air warrants. Uh, this, <laughs> this nice woman is just trying to go to Chicago like the rest of us. Okay. So I got Brendan and Kristen. Look, I literally have the book of people's sins. I'm not certain why you think you can come to heaven and tell me that you have an angel warrant on other angels. I do, because a a lot of them have gotten here um, falsely. (laughs) Bring back the kids from the space shuttle. Hey y'all. So, um, (laughs) this is going to sound crazy. So like, you know, all the adults are now in bed because this is an overnight camp. Yeah. Um, I found (laughs) this. Many, many nights. (laughs) I found this and I think it's moon juice. (laughs) Moon juice. I've heard my mom call it that before. Is it made from that space corn? (laughs) (laughs) Cut to the adults. Cut to the adults. I know I put my moon juice right here. It was here a minute ago. Okay, th- no, the kids are wasted. They're wasted. What are we going to do with a bunch of wasted kids on the Cut back to the kids <laughs> being wasted? <laughs> guys, look, look, I'm in space. We are wasted. <laughs> hey, hey, do you guys I did know? I have blood print on the cockpit. That's <laughs> <awesome>. <laughs> Hey guys, do you know what mission abort means? <laughs> do it. Oh, press uh, the button. Press it. Oh my God. Cut, cut back to the adults. Come back to the adults. Suck a tash. <laughs> <laughs> Suck your tash. <laughs> and that's See? our show. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching, everybody. Woo! Oh, that was so much fun. Hey, everybody. Uh, you go, hey, Kristen, you want to do it? You can do it, Brian. Okay. Um, we have shows here every night on High Wire. Uh, you can go to the YouTube channel that you're watching right now and see every show we've done since we started on November 6th. We have Tomorrow Night Zombie Apocalypse and probably uh, and uh, lots of other great shows coming up for the rest of the week. So check out the calendar at highwireimprov.com. Uh, like Kristen said, follow us on Instagram, follow us on Facebook. Maybe I'll get around to actually using Twitter once in a while. I started it. <laughs> I used it like twice. Don't forget to let us know in the comments if you think we should be using Twitter. Yes, we are one Press subscriber, one subscriber away from a hundred. Bye. Uh, tell your friends. You Bye. can be friends. that hundred. You can be <laughs> <my goodness>. Woo! <laughs> so uh, yeah, thank you everybody for watching. Thank you everybody for jamming. We'll be back here again next Sunday at seven o'clock.